What's up everybody, welcome to the next episode in our Fallout 4 series. In the previous episode we completed Data Recovery and a, The Arrival. In this episode I think we're going to start a couple more side missions in Far Harbor. I think. I haven't tested it out because obviously we've got to record it. So, apparently we need to speak to the Mariner and she'll give us a couple more missions uh, similar to what we've been doing down here. So, let's go have a chat with her. She is just in here. Hey, you, Mariner. With proper tools, the things I can do. If the stowaways keep pushing, one day I'll be gone on the high tide. Then where will they be? The island's restless. Yeah, so maybe she doesn't. Okay. Oh, that's annoying. Where else can we get a a mission here? Apparently it's supposed to be like a great hunt. Alright, well, I guess it is time to head to Nuka World. I can't... I've looked online. I can't think of any missions that we can just easily get started. So... Maybe it's something that we'll, we'll come back to if there is anything. So, yeah, I guess we I guess we got to head on back to the mainland. Where's our boat? Off we go. Yeah, it felt unresolved, but in terms of the main storyline for Far Harbor, we definitely completed that. I had a look online, and there were things like... Um, well, what were they called? They were quests called the Hull, uh, Hull Breach, and there's like Hull Breach 1, 2, and 3. <coughs> and it's hard to work out if we've done 2 and 3 because they just say Hull Breach in our quest log, uh, and then eventually it gets to the Great Hunt. Um, but the Mariner, the, the lady that we were trying to speak to, she's the one that gives you those missions, and she didn't give us diddly squat, so... I don't know. Uh, I've met all the conditions that I can see that I need to, so I don't, I don't know. Maybe we'll come back to it in a little bit and it's just something. Yeah, I don't know. It is what it is. Man, imagine if I could just fast travel while this boat still going. Maybe not. It's alright. Looks like we're going to have a little bit of a walk. I don't think I've done a lot in Nuka World um, when it first came out. I think I did like the main missions or things that were tied to achievements and, and that was kind of it. Feels weird but familiar being back on in the Commonwealth. Bad guy over here. Who do you think you are? Idiot. Doom protect this. Now I, I know I don't need to fight this, but I want to. Oh, Longfellow is stuck with us. Nice. Alright. Focus up. Kind of a little bit surprised I, I didn't come over here during the playthrough. Man, I think I'm hitting that invisible wall. It's like no no no, wrong way. Like right here, I can't I can't get further. 
How am I supposed to get over there? What the fudge? Why wouldn't they have stretched the world limit a little bit further? Would it have really killed them? Like, it's rendered in. My dog's awake, so if you can hear some weird noise in the background, he's like, nice. waiting for his mum to wake up. But he's just like, he's ready. Oh, what the f- Something's charging. Short-circuited. Idiot. Ow. Really? Ooh, you're kinda tough. What the hell is going on here? Did I pick up something? I'm super heavy right now. What did I pick up? Ah, oh, I picked up all that scrap. Crap. Oh, that weighed nothing. Okay. I'm carrying a lot of weapons I don't need to be carrying. Maybe I should drop them off somewhere. A lot of work just getting there. rubber banding. Oh no, that means my game's gonna be unstable. Okay, it's everyone. Let's go. Considering, like, just let me stim you, bro. Like, it takes seconds. Look how much time I'm gonna waste now. Arguing logic with a, a game. God damn it. I guess that's it.
the last chapter. And on behalf of the Nuka Cola Corporation, we'd like to welcome each and every one of you aboard the Nuka Express monorail. For your own safety, please remain seated or utilize the provided handrail while the train is in motion. If you'll direct your attention to the right side of the monorail, you can observe Nuka World's famous Biz Top Mountain. Standing at over 100 meters tall, Biz Top Mountain is the largest man-made structure in Nuka World and features the five-star Biz Top Grill. Coming up in the heart of Nuka World, Nuka Town, USA. So, Harvey bagged another sucker. I only got a minute, so you better listen, and listen good. His name's Gage, Porter Gage, and the truth is, he was set up. This ain't no rescue mission, it's a death trap. But if you somehow make it through alive, I have an interesting offer for you. In the meantime, have fun and put on a good show. Survive the gauntlet. Oh, okay. These guys think they're funny. This is gonna be funny. Well, it's a little bit harder than I was expecting, but nothing we can't handle. I feel like they'd assume you'd go that way to avoid stuff. Does this turn off? Tripwires everywhere.
Save myself the time and frustration. Jesus. I have tons of right away. Nice. Got it. into the tunnels. It's an interesting way to start the DLC. I kind of like it, but I could see a lot of people being like, far out. Just want to play the DLC. Making me run through this. Can't lock me out. Why would I do that? Holy moly. Oh, my mother. Just give me the lock. Yes. That better not have been for that door. Big booms. Big booms. More mines. More locks.
Got it. That's annoying. Ah, didn't see the door. I thought if I moved quick enough, it'd be okay. Mm. We have to do the whole thing again. <laughs> I got greedy at the end there. We're actually not too far back. I won't make the same mistake of fighting the Milex. Just gotta keep running through here. No mind system. Gotta go a little slow here. Did that trigger all of them? I think it might have. I didn't even want it, damn it. Oh man, what is still hitting me? Oh, all of these like thousand bugs behind me. Why did I hit a grenade? What did I think was going to happen? I hope we uh, auto-saved after we left that gas room. Yeah, nice. What an idiot. I could have at least, like, shot it from afar.
Oh, damn. Man, once I get out of here, that's so dead. So dead. This has been a long gauntlet, though. I'm not gonna lie. I reckon that is. I know you're still in there. Who is this? I'm the guy that's gonna get you out of this alive. So listen up. Still there, I take it? Yeah. You ready to listen? All right, I'm listening. My kind of guy. Uh -huh. Damn things invincible. You name it. So sure. I wouldn't expect any. <laughs> you want to win? I stashed a weapon. Yes. Is this a, a squirt gun? Yeah, yeah. I know what it looks like. This isn't going to work. Trust me, it will. Once the water, it'll kill his defenses. But you only have mm -hmm. Consider it done. That's all right. Right. Probably should uh listen to that.
How about we show some respect for our new lead rep? He'll get respect when he earns respect. Amen. All right, all right. Now get the hell out of here. I'll show the boss around. Man, the, the pace that these guys are going. Thanks to you. Not a And what do you know? I get it. Taking out Colt. Now that he's actually gone. All I'm asking. Mm -hmm. Let's just say you got my attention. Good. Sure. There are three raider gangs that run the show in the underworld. The disciples, the operators, and the pack. And yeah, if the name thanks to Colt. Uh -huh. I think you have what it takes. Sounds like fun. Count me in. That's the spirit. Uh -huh. Now I'm sure you got a lot. Uh -huh. Meet me at the overball. Just let me get that straight. Finally. All right, guys, that is where we're going to wrap up today's episode. Bit of a longer one, um, but obviously we had to get through the gauntlet before we could finish it up. Be a bit weird finishing it in the middle. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like, subscribe to the channel. Plenty more Fallout 4 content to come. I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye! Regular gaming. Regular gaming.